we are going to use sample superstore data so click here sample superstore and it will give you a screen like this so as we discussed like this is the data pane and these are all the shelves okay page shelf filter shelf mark shelf and these are all we call it as a card marks card like uh, here you have color card size card text card details card and tooltip tooltip card so let us see we are going to just create a simple graph or a report or a chart and uh, we are going to see how we can use the mark card so here in the left side you can see that you have a segment okay just click on the segment once you click on the segment in the show me pane you can see that only one graph so in the show me you can see that various types of graphs are available okay charts and graphs so here only one table is selected okay so this is what the intelligence of tableau so once if you click on any any column it will show you what are the possible charts which you can create it with that okay so here i have clicked the segment card segment uh, that is a segment column dimension and in the measures i am going to select the profit okay now you can see that once i select the profit it is showing me some more suggestion that is some more charts as a suggestion here that is these are all the other charts which are available okay so now either i can click here what type i want okay either i can click here so this is also possible if i click here you will get a graph like this this is one possibility okay next one is or else what i can do is i can click drag and drop okay i am just going to select this segment drag and drop it in the columns okay drag it in the column shelf and uh, now i'm going to click the profit and uh, drop it in the row shelf so now you can see the difference that this is also a bar graph which is little different than what we have clicked in the show me graph okay so now you can see that it is showing some segments i'm going to show you what changes you can do it with the marks card so in the marks card the very first thing is this is what automatic this is a drop down if you click on the drop down you can see various options like how to change the chart type okay this is an automatic chart type if you want to convert it into a line you can convert if you want to convert it into area you can convert and you have various other options like that let us leave it as such as an automatic and this is the color color okay if you want to change the color of that graph chart you can change it okay or else based on any other column if you want to mark the color for example if you want to uh, see the color based on the um, what to say product okay so you can select the category and move that to the color card so what happens now based on the category the color has been changed if you click on this particular segment that is a blue color it will show you that the category is furniture segment is consumer and profit is 6991 okay and if you select this it will show you a different scenario different values like that or else if you want to see some other thing like based on the ship date or subcategory so you can do that as well okay but you have to choose wisely okay you have to choose wisely that it should show you like um it should show you uh, the proper uh, gra graph okay this is not good right like based on the subcategory it is not good to see so we, if you don't want that you can simply drag and drop out okay which will come back to the normal graph now again i'm clicking here and dropping here the category now let us go to the size card click on the size card and if you try to adjust the size okay you can see the size is adjusted okay so the size you can change it next one is the label if you click show marks on the label if you check that you can see that the marks that is the profit is shown in the chart itself if you unselect it 
it will not be visible and if you want to change something more like the text or something you can change it and if you want to change the uh, font size font uh, size font bold italic whatever the thing if you want to change you can change it this is regarding with the tableau chart and that is to label okay and here marks to label selected label min and max only it has to show something like that or highlighted you select the marks and then if you click here it will show like this okay like only selected one it has to show up okay so this is about label next one is detail if you click on detail so if you want something more detail in that for example if i want to see also the sales that is sum of sales here it is profit right if you want to see the sales details so you can select here and if you see you can see that you are getting the details about the sales as well as the profit of that particular category and the segment okay if you want also to see the discount detail you can set select here and you can see the discount details as well okay and the tooltip see here it is showing that category okay so let us understand if you just go and click here it is showing category segment discount profit and sales if you want to do some formatting in this okay this is what we will call it as a tooltip if you want to do some format in this if you want to format this thing then you can click here tooltip and here you can do whatever you want so for example if it should be bolded one should be bold so like whatever the thing you want you can select and change it okay and if you want to show it as an underlined okay so they have to check these things and show responsive show on hover on response include comma buttons allow selection by category so anything if you want to change it you can change or if you want to insert some more uh, data into it okay for example if you want to insert the data source name okay i can simply edit it okay i can insert here the data source name okay and click ok now if you go and see here you can see that it is sample superstore and uh, whatever the changes which we have done that is shown in the tooltip so this is about the marks card so basic uh, basic decorations and basic formatting can be done with the marks card so you might have seen that the color card will accept only one entry okay size card it will change the size of the graph label you can just uh, give some labels to your graph detail you can add many things into the detail and the tooltip which whatever you want to display to the uh, viewer or to your stakeholders you have you can show that fine and one more thing you might have noticed that here it is showing as a profit okay and if you simply drag and drop it over here it is showing like sum of profit so let us i'll do it again so if i don't want profit to be displayed here i can simply drop it down okay so this is profit right if i drag and drop it in the rows it is automatically converted into the sum of profit okay some profit okay so if you want to change this aggregation for example if you want to see the average profit or if you want to see something other than this sum then simply click here okay you have an option called measures go to the measures and here you can see average median count minimum maximum percentile standard deviation and variance so you can see various other options as well so if you click on average you can see the changes happening here and if you click on that you can see the average value other than the sum values in the profit section okay so you can change that as well even if you want to change here some of discount so you can click it and change the measures as well so these are all possible with tableau with the single clicks and if you want to change this appearance so for example i don't want this other than this i want some other uh, type of chart which is shown here like it might be the stack bars so if you click on the stack any show me okay any graph or chart in the show me you can see that 
and the down in here you can see the information about it okay so just uh, uh, see i'm going to click on i'm going to hover over the stack bars so you can see that for a stack bar you have to try one at least one or more dimension should be there and at least one or more measures should be there then only you can create a stacked bar if you hover over the table you need one or more dimension one or more measures okay if you want to change something you can simply click here where it will be changed and as i told if you want to change the color you can change it here and if you want to change the various type of the col various colors like not only in the combination of green light green to the dark green light blue to the dark blue other than that if you want to change some other colors you can also change it here you can make it here like this okay and click apply and click okay where you can see various colors over here i hope you enjoyed this video if you have any doubt in this you can leave your doubts in the comment section and if you want to learn some other topic about this uh, in tableau particularly if you have any trouble while working please let me know thank you take care and bye bye